So I'm walking along this public trail the other day, looking down, staring at my gear that I'm carrying with me. Not really thinking about much. And right about at this point up here, I look left. I didn't have to look far, they're about a foot off the road. I see this patch of about a hundred leeks. They're just starting to turn yellow and I just couldn't believe it. <laughs> you know, all these people are walking and riding this trail. It's a pretty well-worn trail. And, uh, and they're all walking past this patch of 100 leaks or so right here. Here's the trail, here's the leaks. Here's the trail, here's the leaks. Here's the trail, here's the leaks. <laughs> and then later on I'm walking along and I see a couple more small patches. You know, nice little clusters. 50 here, 100 there. A couple individual plants just scattered around, some down there. You could keep walking, I'm sure there's more clusters. And I find some more pretty good sized patches. Some right here, good number right here, right here, all up through here, you know, hundreds in this spot for sure. All the way up here, just carpeting everywhere. Leaks all over the place. And they just keep going up, <laughs> going up. This might be a patch of a thousand, you know. They're all over the place here. It's going straight up this hill. They go over all the way to that log there. All the way up to here. This is probably a patch of a thousand or so. You know, rough guess. Well, pretty much everywhere I walk off the trail, I still see little clusters like this. You know, 50 or 100. There's probably a dozen little clusters like this that I've seen. I barely started looking. And there's like little individual plants around trees here, left and right. A lot of little clusters along the way. There's another little patch of a couple hundred or so. Start out by following this edge here. Right on down tight, like four feet wide. All these guys. And then they start to spread out. They're tucked in this brush here. There's a little cluster of them over there under those logs. There's still few of them here and they thicken up again right in here see them there and there and there they just keep following on down right in here whole bunch of them thick all that all that there's a few scattered in there all right here and they start to thin out down here but there's still a few of them I see them poking out there's a nice patch right here off the trail, at least a hundred. You can see them tucked into this grass and these ferns. Right here, all the way down to here. A whole bunch of them right here along the, the brush. Tucked in these sticks. Right in here. All these guys. With the broad leaves right here. I'm going up. And they start to get more thin, but they're still scattered and in, in, tucked in these, these down trees here. Up there. And there's just little clusters left and right that I'm not bothering to videotape. There's another little stretch of them here. we are a little thinner, but it's a decently long stretch, like 50 feet. Right in here is at least 30, 30 of them. And then tucked down right there. All through here, just a few of them, but you know, at least 50 in this little stretch right here. Right down into here. And then they're right here, these green and yellow guys, all these guys, these yellow ones. And they go up into here, and the flood took some of them out, but I think there was more right there. See them hanging over the edge. It's a beautiful patch up in here, back closer to where I started. Right here is probably like, I don't know, 50 or you know, something like that. And it just keeps going. There's a little cluster. There's little clusters like that everywhere. All in between these big clusters. And here's another 10 or 20 right there through here. And right here it just spreads out into another 100 or so. All these guys. The broad yellowish leaves will turn more yellow as the season goes on. 
right here. Still a good number of them. All the way up here. All the way up here, and I haven't even seen this yet. I'm still exploring this. I've just barely started. Over here, there's another. Oh, at least a couple. Uh, at least a hundred, maybe two hundred or more. All through this. All these guys right here. Right here. And up. It just keeps going up. There's a few scattered right here. This. Real thick with them. Probably a couple hundred in this patch. Start to spread out again. Looks like right next to that patch of 200, going back down, there's another thinner patch right here. All these guys, not quite as thick, still a good number. Right here, right there, probably another patch of maybe 50. Straight through here. Another patch right here, 30 at least. And over here, a little cluster. And goes up just a little bit they spread out and then looks like up here there's a bigger cluster oh yeah that one's a good solid 50 plants right here just in the open woods and it goes over to here and it just starts turning into tons of them I think this connects to the to the big cluster I showed you before of about a thousand. But I didn't walk it all the way up. Just all over the place. Look at all of them. Yeah, that's the log. That's the log I was pointing at earlier. This is the other side of it that I didn't show you. Just tons more. Hundreds on top of that thousand. On top of the other hundreds. They're all over the place, man. It's just a carpet of them. Look at this. Thousands. Easily thousands total. Easily. Possibly many thousands. Carpeting. Whole area down there. 100 feet away. Still carpeting. Just look at all of them. <laughs> it's crazy. Here's a leak up close. Each one has a couple leaves and a bulb at the end of it. The bulb kind of has a garlic, oniony hint. And the leaves, you can eat them too. In soups or salads. I'm just going to take five gallons. It's just a real small percentage of what's here total. You know, you want to... It would be difficult with a group like this, I think. But with a smaller group, you definitely want to with any group really, you want to be mindful of over harvest because the way these guys reproduce, you don't want to take most of them. But I think I've been underestimating them. Every time I go 50, 100, 1,000, whatever, that's 100 or 50 or 1,000 of clusters. Each of these clusters is 3 to 10 or 15 leaks. So, you know, we may have been talking tens of thousands I was walking past just today and I haven't even come close to exploring the whole mountainside so we're talking a lot of leaks could fill a dump truck not that you'd ever want to do that but <laughs> you could hypothetically just tons mother load more than you'd ever need and no one's touching them <laughs> 